Welcome to the A320 Mentor Channel Podcast. Episode, Managing Abnormal Operations, Ecom Discipline and Task Sharing. Welcome back to the A320 Mentor Channel, your go-to source for in-depth operational knowledge, technical system understanding, and flight crew best practices. Today's episode focuses on one of the most critical areas in Airbus operations. Managing Abnormal Operations, with a detailed look at Ecom Discipline, memory items, and task sharing. This is essential knowledge for every Airbus pilot, whether you're heading into your next simulator session, flying the line, or sharpening your operational discipline. Section 1. Ecom Handling Philosophy The moment an abnormal situation is detected, your first responsibility is to fly the aircraft. Maintain a safe flight path before you begin any Ecom or QRH actions. After takeoff or during a go-around Ecom, Read and do. Actions should be delayed until reaching at least 400 feet AGL. However, if the flight path is already safe and stable, actions may begin sooner. Bottom line, flight path first, procedure second. Section 2, Memory Items and Immediate Actions. In time-critical scenarios such as engine fire, smoke, or unreliable airspeed, there's no time to reference ECOM or QRH. That's where memory items come into play. These must be known by heart, practiced regularly, and executed with precision. Your ability to recall and apply these items under stress is part of what separates proficient pilots from great ones. Section 3. Task Sharing in Abnormal Operations Task sharing is more than an SOP requirement. It's a foundation of CRM. The pilot flying, PF, continues with the flying duties, manages navigation, and initiates any abnormal procedure. The PF also communicates with ATC and monitors the aircraft's trajectory. The pilot monitoring, PM, manages the ECOM, QRH, or OEB procedure. They read and perform the checklist items aloud and always request confirmation before clearing each step. Both pilots must stay aligned, communicate clearly, and support each other throughout the abnormal event. Section 4 ECOM Actions Step by Step Here's how ECOM actions should be carried out. 1. Reset the master caution or warning. 2. Announce the failure. 3. Confirm the failure with reference to the overhead panel and system display. 4. The PF calls. Ecom actions. 5. The PM performs the read and do checklist step by step. 6. Confirm each action before pressing the CLR button. 7. Stop ECOM to manage other priorities such as ATC calls or configuration changes. 8. Resume ECOM. 9. Review the status page thoroughly. 10. Announce. ECOM actions complete. If a QRH reference is triggered by ECOM, keep it displayed while executing the QRH. Section 5. When to stop ECOM. Pause ECOM flow during workload heavy moments such as Configuration changes after takeoff. Barometric settings. Communication with ATC. Coordination with cabin crew. This ensures situational awareness is maintained and critical phases are not rushed. Section 6. Status page review. The status page provides a complete picture of aircraft condition and deferred actions. These are performed when workload permits. Examples include. Normal checklist completion. Engine relight procedures. System resets, only as permitted by QRH. Reading the status early gives a head start in planning for approach, landing, or diversion. Section 7. Ecom Alert Disappearance If the Ecom Alert disappears during the checklist, the action is no longer needed. For example, if a fire is extinguished after the first bottle, the related warning will disappear, and the procedure may be considered complete. However, any remaining ECOM procedures must still be completed. Conclusion Proper ECOM management is one of the most important technical and non-technical competencies in Airbus operations. Fly first, then manage. Know your memory items. Share tasks deliberately. Communicate with precision. Use the status page wisely. And above all, don't rush. If you found this episode helpful, Support the A320 Mentor channel by subscribing and joining for only 99 cents per month. You'll unlock exclusive tutorials, 
simulator walkthroughs, and deep dive system briefings designed to help you fly smart, safe, and confidently, no matter the situation. Until next time, keep learning, fly smart, and stay sharp.